get your product, product, or product. <laughs> April 15, 2018, Jack Troubadour was reported abducted by an unknown alien race. I am Jack Troubadour. And now, now, ladies and gentlemen, with your favorite social fan, Jack Troubadour. Schizophrenic, manic, manic story time. Hi. Jack has been transformed into an entity that lives among the waves and electrons of entertainment. He travels riding the waves of particles leaping from one television or radio to another one parallel universe at a time. I am the Prince of Misfit. Prince of Misfit. Or it may just all be a part of his schizophrenic hallucinations.
get to planet hallucinations of a bell trying to control his mind. Scientists were so excited that their experiments actually worked that they tortured hundreds of dogs and then they ate them. You can't even trust a psychiatrist not to brainwash and eat your family pets. Come on now. Or maybe it was all in my head. It doesn't make a difference with most schizophrenics cannot tell the difference between what's real and what's not. Nor do we give a fuck. Pavlov and I are not snobbish or rude, but most people are. And it makes Pavlov act up. What's up, buddy? Really? Well, I can tell him, but it doesn't mean I'll listen. Well, all right. Pavlov wanted me to tell you that the voice in my head is that of a crazy, witty, wise guy of a shadow hound world now. He is part of a paradox. Wow! Oh, really? Wow, Pavlov. Holy shit. I don't know if I should tell him that or not. All right, fuck it. I'll tell him what the paranoid Pavlov said. The crazy hound speaks a riddle as he giggles. He is the shadow hound. 
Yes, I said it. He most certainly is. The crazy little wise guy of the Shadow Man, world renowned. I could tell that he fluently spoke paradox by the way he repeatedly chanted, he is the crazy witty wise guy of a shadow hound, world renowned. The crazy hound carries dog tags on the end of his dog tail. He uses these dog tags to hypnotize the insane brain. You are mesmerized. You are courageous and strong, strong, confident, 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 confident and secure. 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 The crazy hound shouted, America's booty! The police were called. They prepared a room with cold walls. The meat wagon arrived, and the brain surgeon sharpened his knives. All they wanted to do was dissect his brain and leave him insane. That's when I spoke up. A shadow hound world renowned as an endangered species. We have no other choice but to reassure his continued survival and return him back to the wild among his own kind. Understood? Thank you. You are among his own kind. Somewhere such as Area 51, the Twilight Zone, or maybe here at a common show. You may be asking, what do the aliens have to do with it? The psychology or extraterrestrial study of humans? A science passed on through alien culture? Ain't no science? The time period between Neanderthal and the current computer age is too short. One day we invent the wheel, and the next day everybody has a Star Trek communicator? Come on, now you expect us to believe that? I talk bullshit. Apparently, aliens have lived among us, disguising themselves as politicians for some time now. Some scientists believe that aliens and Neanderthals mingle at some caveman wild sex party. Anyone got a condom? Oh shit, what do you mean we're out? Try the paper sack and a little damn trick. Wild OG, human and alien DNA flying everywhere. Oh, so I'm close. Compare the similarities in these two photos. Both walk upright and both have a set of two hands and two feet just for a starting point to a further evaluation. Oh, look, honey. A Billy Idol Wobble Hat. If there are aliens among us, you may be thinking we must prepare ourselves for such a booty program attack. Who will keep our asses safe? Who will we turn to when technology becomes so advanced that all of Earth becomes a paradise? Wow! Will aliens lead us to our salvation or to our doom? Maybe not. So you think I'm crazy, don't you? To safeguard our asses, I will disguise myself as one of them. A counter invasion. To walk among them, living with them, eating with them, sleeping with them. Like an informant on Facebook. The counter invasion has already started. Hold on, I got a phone call. It's them! It's them! Yes, honey. Yeah, I'm here on schizophrenic television. Oh, no. No booty problem tonight. Okay, honey. Well, I gotta go. Gosh, that was weird. You might be questioning my sanity by now. Just keep them straight. There will be no sexual problem. Ever. I don't know why she insists on asking. Have you ever smelt the funk off a giant lizard lady's breath? She's in desperate need of a tic tac. Get your nasty military ass in the bathtub. You might be questioning my sanity by now. I have over 30 years of experience with the witch doctors of psychiatry. I am a guru of madness. For a clear understanding of schizophrenia, let me demonstrate the last thing a schizophrenic sees before that knock his ass out cold. He's resisting, resisting! Lights flashing all around, radio communicating between Earth and some unknown light bulb. You might be pressing my family right now. Remember, schizophrenics cannot identify between what is real and what is not. And most don't give a shit. 
to them the hallucinations are real. It would be like somebody telling you that your reality is not real. Could you accept that? I got a fucking alien coming at me with a giant fucking needle. Hell yes, I'm resisting. Hell yes, I'm panicked. Realistically. Wouldn't you panic if an alien came at you with a giant fucking needle? But if I didn't have a message, I wouldn't be here. I'm here to fill a gap in the misunderstanding of schizophrenia. I'm taking a stand against physical and psychological abuse. I'm using comedy to shed understanding. Well, there is none. How can we trust a profession that is medical practices were derived from medieval torture dungeons? Straight jackets were derived from medieval torture dungeons when they didn't have enough chains to go around. What are we gonna do? We ran out of chains. Cross his arm in front of him, tie his shirt sleeves together behind his back. Now he's stuck in his own clothing. Today's psychology is a proven science. Although it is a proven science, it is also just an opinion. Well, my point is, laughter is more of a humor than criticism and cruelty, which many schizophrenics face on a daily basis. So come on and laugh at this. God bless. Dear Facebook, the counter invasion into alien life seems to be successful. I have discovered that extraterrestrials love television and that I may be famous on another planet. In an alternate reality of television called TV Dominion, I will keep anyone interested updated. During the Academy Award winning film Picnic Mind Control was brewing. An attempt to steal our minds and turn us into puppets in the new age was negotiated. uses guided, intense concentration, and focused attention to achieve a heightened state of awareness that is sometimes called a trance. Much like focusing upon this pendulum you are watching now. Focus. 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 Be filled with positivity. Be filled with positivity. Be filled with positivity. Feel the positive energy come over you. The positive energy come You are a source of strength. Join me. Manifestation, nation, 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 Takes an order, order. Hey, baby, baby. from your mother. Travel night, building blocks of life. Living day and night. Yeah, no time, no time, no time. Focus upon the pendulum, pulling you out from your slump. Here's the time. Here's the time. A weather of tangled thoughts, negativity, 
most beautiful, kindness, crazy bitch I ever met. Jack believes that the voices in his head are coming from the alternate reality of the love dimension. Well, how about you? You still think you're invisible? It appears that I am invisible. Especially when that receptionist says the doctor can't see me right now. Just to the door, Dr. Normal will see you now. Would I shrug ahead? Oh, no. Thanks, anyhow. So, what have you been up to since then? Get a load of this guy. I picked up a new movie by Jack Troubadour. Which is me. Which is why I may be so confused. In the movie they explain quantum physics and psychology. It was like I was looking at myself in a parallel dimension, a parallel television. Was I really? Was I? I was watching myself from a parallel universe. Parallel universe. Parallel universe. Parallel universe. Parallel universe. I'm confused. Maybe from some parallel universe. Somewhere, somewhere out parallel there. I'm famous. I'm maybe famous on another planet. On another or some planet. parallel universe. Planet. Have I opened the door to some quantum reality? Quantum reality? Quantum I'm reality. watching myself. Quantum reality. Quantum reality. In some dirty hotel room. Maybe I am famous on another planet. Another planet. Another planet. Maybe I am some reality show in a parallel dimension. Parallel maybe dimension. nobody on Earth was meant to know. I have to find the author. I have to, I have to go there. I have to. to a parallel universe. 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 So, so, is that what you've been doing? Doing? Watching movies. Thinking that they took you to some parallel universe. No, I'm not that same movie at all. I know you did that right. If you have ever been under psychiatric care and think you have been involved in a conspiracy, you are probably right. I'm writing is correct, correct, correct. For 45,000. Never for anybody. Uh, uh. Almost. Yeah. You know what? Right? Yeah. I also have some paperwork for you sign. Who is that you were speaking with with in a waiting room? That's my friend Ankle Biter. He's a mental werewolf. Oh yeah? Come on. He's in the waiting room. Ankle Biter. Ankle Biter. Ankle Biter. Ankle Biter. Ankle Biter. Where'd you go, Ankle Biter? Go, Ankle Biter. 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 Jack really should read the paperwork the doctor asks him to sign before he signs it. <laughs> Jack has found the lost dimension. 
He does not know if he is hallucinating all the women or not. But apparently, he is seeing somebody. <laughs> <laughs> Jack? Hey Jack, it's Ankle Buyer. You know me? I found out for sure that I'm not invisible. Wow. It's just a. Uh, they're the only one that can see me. Whoa. Don't worry about a thing, Jack. Jack. I'm gonna get you out of here. Out of here. Oh, Jack, we're gonna be best friends. We're gonna prove that bitches are hoes and tricks, but a dog is a man's best friend. Wow. <laughs> Isn't that great, Jack? I'm not crazy. You are! <laughs> Jack really enjoys all of his girlfriends from the love dimension. Here he is again with the ladies and waking him up would just be rude at this point. Nobody enjoys being woke up from a wet dream. <laughs> Your room to wake you up in your wet dream, but it has to be done. Come. Come.